Hi, Josh from Team Area 419. I want to show you today how we uh, swap our barrels mid-season uh, without having to send the entire rig back to John to have one screwed on. Um, I've already taken my action and barrel out of the stock. I've removed the scope. Uh, I also removed the trigger too. And I have the, the action and the barrel in the barrel vise here. I have a defiance wrench that slides in the back of the action. I have a big long breaker bar. John likes to put these suckers on pretty tight. They have a hundred foot pounds is what they're on with. And sometimes the Cerakote might make it a little bit more difficult to break. So I'm going to pop this sucker loose. It always makes a loud snap like that. And Tyler found out that you can actually break your trigger. Um, he sheared one off once when he did this. So we're going to pull this guy off. I'm going to clean it up. And I'll get the other barrel in the vise for you, and I'll show you how I put it back on here in just a minute. Now to continue the installation, I put some anti-seize on the, the pretty threads here, uh, just to make it easier to get it off next time. I got my receiver cleaned up. I'll go ahead and start that on there. Wipe all the extra anisees off. All right, we got our torque wrench, and it's already pre-preset to a hundred foot pounds. Just another to be sure. Alright, that's all there is to it. I can now use my 223 trainer bolt. I took out my 6mm bolt. Get it cleaned up and lubed up. Put back in the stock and scope one and it's good to go. Let us know if you have any questions. Thanks.